We move on to community football. Aroma Stars football team beat Kasaka 4-2 on penalties after the match ended 2-2 in regulation time during the final of the Youth Day tournament organized by the Kafue Fars Youth League Zone 18. More in the following report. Football lovers in Kafue celebrated Youth Day through a tournament organized by the FAS Kafue Youth League at Matanda Ground. The tournament, which had three finals in the boys under 12, boys under 17, and girls under 17, was sponsored by Hafe Hardware Investments and Kafue District Council Chairperson Dr. Bumba Malambo. Also witnessing the games was FAS Lusaka Province Youth Chairperson Danny Chimakatongo. In the under-17 boys category, Aroma Stars, who are the New Year champions, met with Kasaka United. It was an entertaining game which saw end-to-end -end action, but after regulation time, it was two apiece, and referee Godfrey Zewa took the game straight to penalties. Aroma Stars were splendid as they converted all their penalties and beat Kasaka United 4-2 to be champions again. In the under-17 girls category, it was Aroma Stars again facing Young Green Eagles Academy. An early goal by Mondem Tale is all that Aroma Stars needed to win the title through a one-new scoreline. First, Kafue Youth League's on 18 patron, Chisham Leng, has emphasized on the talent which is in the district and it needs tapping. The turnout has been good, though uh, uh, some teams have, have dominated, like the Aroma Stars and uh, the, the ZNS team, they have actually dominated in most of the categories. But all in all, uh, everybody has been given uh, an opportunity to participate, and they are, they, our youth are very happy. Kafu has been, has, been, has been the basis of talent in terms of football. We have produced a lot, a lot of players from here. So even now, we are very confident that we have a lot of uh, upcoming talent, and we will be there soon. Men sponsor Stephen Haringa says the main interest is to seek a few talent being tapped. Our interest is uh, to support our youth, to promote our talent from our community. Because us as the half a general dealers, we do business in Kafue for many years. We've been here in Kafue, we are, look, we are looking at our young people, young, young boys, yeah, they are, what is they are doing in, in the community and what. Then we decided to say, no, let us see do something for them so that you can come in for through these sports. The winners went away with a set of jerseys and a trophy. Modern Singalaz NBC Sport, Kafue. Right, so that was the action in Kafue and in the studio now I'm joined by football coach who is also an administrator, Chilando Kupikwa. Welcome to Spoton. Thank you so much uh, uh, Modern and uh, Go, good afternoon to our great viewers and okay. our great listeners. Right. <coughs> Let me start with your reactions regarding the uh, Kafue tournament. Exactly. Uh, the youth football. First and foremost, uh, kudos to Lusaka Province Football Association because uh, it's the one that has designed this type of uh, football setup and development where the, it has zoned uh, the whole entire province into zones. And uh, also kudos to the sponsors, especially that Zone 18 is actually one of the most active uh, zones in Lusaka, among of the, the other zones. Mm -hmm. And uh, more than when you look at the background of Kafue, this is where Kelvin Tari Malaza came from, the late international striker, uh, perished in 1993, and the current uh, Leicester City striker. Pats on Dhaka is also coming from Kafue. So you can tell that uh, indeed Kafue has a talent. And just like what the sponsor said, that uh, we need to tap this talent for sure. There is talent in Kafue. But it goes with that kind and that level of organization that we saw. And uh, I think more than I would say, let uh, the other parts of this country also do something like that, that level of organization. They, I think we're going to see Zamen football develop. Uh, develop much from this level. Okay. Do you think national team material can be tapped uh, from uh, such a level of football, let's say maybe under 17 or under 15? Exactly. I'll give you one of example. Is uh, Chilufia, who came from uh, Northern Province in Pande Youth Academy. Mm -hmm. uh, these are some of the places where I've been as a coach. And uh, 
it doesn't matter where a person is coming from, but what matters mm -hmm. is the input which that player, uh, that person or a player uh, has. Mm -hmm. Anyone who can represent the nation doesn't matter where he's coming from. Mm -hmm. But what matters is the input of that particular player. Right. <laughs> okay, so yes, that was the action in Kafiowe.